Beckham artist almost sidelining a kid's football team. Good evening, I'm Dominique Soxa. I'm Bill Maestro. Thanks for joining us. The parents tell us that this man promised to make the uniforms, but then disappeared with all their cash. Channel 2's Bill Spencer is live in Friendswood tonight with the help that this team now needs. Bill? Yes, uh, Bill and Dominic, the game of football is, out of, is all about getting hit hard and getting back up again, as my two buddies here will tell you. But now the members of the Beast Mode Junior football team here in Friendswood have been hit very hard. Every one of their parents shelled out more than 225 bucks to buy brand new uniforms like these, but the vendor skipped out on them. And now these little boys have nothing. Whether they're out on the football field playing their guts out or just goofing around at home, the 120 members of the Friendswood Beast Mode football team give everything they have for each other. They play with heart. I wonder why would that man steal from us? We're just kids. We didn't do anything to him. But now a heartless sports uniform vendor from Atlanta, Georgia, has sucker punched every member of the Beast Mode team by taking $12,000, which was meant to pay for brand new uniforms. This guy is, is a scumbag. He has taken our money. He has not given us the product that he promised us. With nothing to wear, this group of parents quickly tried to fashion makeshift uniforms out of black jerseys and yellow lettering so the kids could play their first game Saturday. I'm not gonna say it's destroying me because it takes more than this to destroy me, but it is very devastating. But now, with the vendor nowhere to be found and not returning the team's phone calls, parents are hoping to raise $12,000 to buy uniforms from someone else. As for the kids, they're determined to play on, and they have this message for that uniform vendor. Nobody can mess with us. We're a family. He's great. Now, the president of the Beast Mode football team has put together a GoFundMe account to try and raise $12,000 to once again buy new uniforms for these young boys, buy them from a different company altogether. If you'd like to donate and help this tough team of great little guys, you can go to our webpage, clicktohouston.com, and we have a link to that GoFundMe account. Reporting live in Friendswood, Bill Spencer, KPRC, Channel 2 News. Thank you for sharing.